The California Housing Finance Agency launched the Dream for All shared application loan program just two weeks ago. It offered qualified first-time buyers up to 20% off their purchase price of a house or condo with 0% interest on that extra money. But the shared equity program has already run out of funds and can't take on any more applicants. I got a lot of new clients' uh, inquiries who said they were interested in this program and only this program. They wouldn't be able to buy without it. And those, those clients, plenty got pre-approved, but unfortunately the funds ran out so quickly uh, that a lot of clients didn't get to take action with it. Real estate broker Ali Urgabi says it's a particularly attractive program compared to other similar offerings. The help was available to households whose earnings were below Cal HFA's income limit. For San Diego County, that's all the way up to $211,000, so a lot of people qualified. But that drove demand much higher than the supply of the funds. Veronica Remsbottom was one of the many San Diegans who applied and was pre-approved, but didn't get the loan. And I was really excited about it. As a single mom, I've been looking to get pre-approved and into my house uh, since 2018, and yet it just keeps getting delayed for one reason or another. Last Friday, the Cal HFA website announced that all the funds have been reserved. Urgabi says she's telling her dozens or so interested clients that all is not lost, even though the funding is gone for now. There's a lot of clients who had hope that this was you know, going to be possible for them, and then um, they're losing hope, like, okay, I'm out of the market again now, right? And so one thing that I'm talking about is there are other down payment assistance programs, but there's also already talk that there will be more funds coming into a program like this because it is so very needed. State lawmakers had set aside $500 million for the program as part of the 2022-23 budget, but a difficult economic situation for California led to a 40% cut and the program ended up with $300 million. That was expected to assist about 2,500 home buyers. Cal HFA told KPBS that additional funds are dependent on the state budget process, which will play out in the coming months. Jacob Ayer, KPBS News.